Yeah, you made it on a legal right-hand turn back there. Well, it slants as otherwise. Look, buddy, I don't care about a sign. If I say you made an illegal right-hand turn, you made an illegal right-hand turn. Just be aware, I will be challenging this in court. You don't say. Get out of the car, now! Uh, I'm afraid that's not possible. I'm handicapped. You're handicapped? Yes, I am. I'm not buying it. I think you're making the whole thing up. Why would I lie about being handicapped? Go, out of the car. I can't. Playtime's over. Hey, Stop hey, let me go! Oh! Stop resisting! Hello, sir. Hello. License and registration, please. All right, no problem. May I ask why you pulled me over? Yeah, you made it on a legal right-hand turn back there. I'm, I'm sorry, I believe you're mistaken. Excuse me? I don't make mistakes. Well, the sign says otherwise. What sign? The sign that says right turn on red from right lane only, and I was clearly on the right lane. Look, buddy, I don't care about a sign. If I say you made an illegal right-hand turn, you made an illegal right-hand turn. Okay. Okay. It's all right. You know, go ahead. Write me a ticket. But, um, just be aware I will be challenging this in court. You don't say. Oh, it is so. Get out of the car. Excuse me? You heard me. Get out of the car. Now. Uh, I'm afraid that's not possible. I'm handicapped. You're handicapped. Yes, I am. Why don't you have a handicap license plate on your car? You know you're supposed to have one if you are indeed handicapped. Well, look, I just moved into the area, so you know I hadn't had a chance to go to the DMV to change it. I'm not buying it. I'm calling this in. What? Dispatch, this is Jacobs. Dispatch, go ahead. Traffic stop. License number Alpha 690, Romeo Zebra 8421. Any priors on this individual? Officer Jacobs, his record is clean. Copy that. Mr. Washington claims to be paraplegic. We have any record of him being handicapped? Negative, officer. That makes sense. I think he's making the whole thing up. I got it from here. Over and out. Everything all right, officer? So, let me ask you something. How long have you uh, been in this situation? Three months. What happened? Well, I was driving my motorcycle, and I got hit by a drunk driver. They had to rush me to the hospital. They said I could never walk again. It's terrible. Well, I had to navigate this new reality of mine. It's uh, really, really interesting. It's kind of hard. It's a sad, sad story, man. You know what? What? I'm not buying it. I think you're making the whole thing up. Why would I lie about being handicapped? I don't know. That's what I'm trying to figure out. Sir? I'm not lying. I'm telling you the truth. I'm gonna have to take you down to the station to investigate this. For what? What did I do? Lying to a police officer? I'm not lying. Let's go. Out of the car. I can't. Playtime's over. Hey, Stop hey, let me go. Oh, hey. Stop resisting. Stop resisting. Hey, hey. Stop resisting. Ow. Get off me. Get off me. Dispatch, this is Jacobs. I need backup immediately. Send him to the corner of 4th and Vine. Backup is on the way. Stop. Ow. Stop it. You're under arrest. You have the right to remain silent. And I highly recommend that you exercise that right. Calvary's on the way. It's your last chance to come clean, kid. Backup's here. Thanks for coming, Sarge. Why is this man lying on the ground, handcuffed? You better have a good explanation for this. Absolutely. I pulled him over for making an illegal right-hand turn. He tried to overpower me immediately. Luckily, I was able to detain and cuff him. But that's a lie! He knew I was handicapped, he grabbed me, and he dragged me to the ground. Is this true, Jacobs? Is he handicapped? No, he's making the whole thing up. I have proof. Why did you pull him over again? 
for making an illegal over the left hand turn. I thought you said it was a right hand turn. I mean, yeah. Yeah, it was a legal right hand turn. And that's another lie. Shut up. The grown ups are talking here. Sir, he's been lying to me the whole time, including this so called handicapness. So, why do you think he's been lying to you? Because dispatch has no record of him being handicapped. So, when you pulled him out of his car, did he try to run away? Or stand up? Or try to make use of his legs? No. No, I didn't do any of that. Did it ever cross your mind that he might be telling you the truth? Well, sir, as I said, dispatch has no record of him being handicapped, and he doesn't have a handicapped license plate. Officer Jacobs, from my point of view, this seems to be an egregious display of police overreach. What are you talking about? Get the handcuffs off this man and help me put him back in the car. Sir, he's faking it. Officer Jacobs, now, let's go! I called you here for help. Not telling the truth. Ugh. Unbelievable. Sorry about that. Oh, come on. I mean, he's clearly faking it. You can move your legs. Unbelievable. Oh. Okay, sir, you're free to go. All right, thank you, Gil. I th th thought that guy was going to kill me. Uh, don't worry about Officer Jacobs. I deal with him. And don't judge Mango Park by one sorry excuse of a police officer. I make sure he learned his lesson and this kind of stuff don't happen again. Good, 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 good. All right. Thank you, sir. All right. I can't believe you just let him go. You didn't even give him a ticket. What is wrong with you? When I get back to the station, I'm going to make sure I file a report about this. And I'm personally going to go to Captain Porter and tell him about what happened here today. Sir, it was just a misunderstanding. There's no need for all of that. Misunderstanding? Let me ask you a question. If that was the white man on the ground, would you have treated him like that? Well, white man, what? I already know the answer. It's a rhetorical question. Sir, look, even if he was right, we can just keep this between us. What do you say? No. Our job is to observe, report, and protect the citizens of this community. The only thing you seem to be concerned about is flexing your power and abusing it. You should be ashamed of yourself. If I get one more infraction, I'm going to be suspended. So what? Maybe a suspension is what you need so you can learn how to treat people with dignity and respect. Sarge, please. If I were you, I'd polish up that resume. You're going to need it. I have a feeling you're going to be looking for a job real soon. Have a nice day, Kyle. Thanks a lot. So glad I called you.